got right. The coach got it right. That's perfect, right? That is absolutely perfect. If he could keep bowling, I think he's got a great chance of getting wicket with balls like that. He's drawn him forward. It's not forward enough so he can drive. He's playing defensive. And he's just left him up the seam and he's missed it. Force runs on the board. Jeff starts off for the boundary. That's well played, so it's straight as he pushed it away. So he seems just at this early stage of the Gibbs to have settled his mind a little bit, which uh, from South Africa's point of view will be very good. That's crashed off the back foot. That's a strength. That's gone to the boundary like a tracer bullet. Collector or pusher. He's basically a four ball hitter. And I say he's got tremendous hand eye coordination. He's a wonderful rugby player. Nice shot. What a lovely little push. He didn't try to hit it too hard. A little too straight. Not a bad ball, just a little straight. Little fall, and he just pushed it. You know, as I was saying, uh, I told that you've got to play as a little bit of control at times. He's gone outside the line a bit, covered his off stump well, then worked it to the gap, a little firm push. Whoa, that was a cracking shot, wasn't he? Watch the swing. Right up there, swing in, and weave it through the covers. Just overstepping on that occasion. Lovely stride forward. Harry Kirsten, good balance, head on top of the shot. And he leans into it nicely. That's a cracking stroke from Gibbs. Standing up tall and backs it through covers. Blitzed away for four. 34 for Manu. Picked it up so easily. The man on the boundary is too fine. Picked the, pick the gap, played it well. The boundary picked it up. Yes. More runs. This time in front of Square. Zahid Khan just drifting down leg side. Keeps just keeps picking him off. There's wide open spaces there. Wide open side. Second consecutive occasion. Got front on the board. To pile on the pressure on the opposition. Make them earn their runs. And Gibbs being a gifted stroke maker, if you stifle him for runs, he's always trying to travel again. And then you have a chance. Slapped away for four by Kirsten. That's just too wide from Zayed Khan. Half shot. Good shot it was. So the pressure slowly being transferred back onto the Indians now, I feel. Well, that's too wide and too short, and there's no one there to cover that boundary, and Kirsten collects another four. Easy put away, short and wide. The minute he wasn't going to be playing, I'd like to have had Kum Lady bowl into more right-handers rough. And they would have been Agaka, and he certainly wouldn't have surrendered his wicket like the rest of them did. End of the over, 16 gone, 61 for no wicket. It's a no ball, and it's a caress through cover, that's racing away. The outfield is speeding up, and it's gone for four. Yes, and something else that happens is because you haven't got protection, if you've got it. Sarab Ganguly is starting to ring the changes now. He's taking the slip out, Kirsten will be happy with that. Now, he's taking the slip out, third man, and the ball swinging towards that area. Yeah. Well, for me, the guy that's going to have to do the job for India is this man, Anil Kumble. He's not going to find too much help in the pitch right now. He starts off pretty poorly, drops it short. It's a nice shot by Kirsten. Waited for it, just lent into the stroke. And that's racing away through extra cover for another four. You certainly get the added value for shot here. You beat the field. You saw those problems now. You change bowler just before lunch. There's no stopping. Oh, 
swing and it's swung straight off the bat as well Kirsten didn't even move and that's gone for four once more well, that's some pressure from one of the ends next difficult captaincy Harry Kirsten is on 37, 83 for no wicket. Oh, it's in the air, just a little tied up that time, Kirsten. So no ball, and it's also four. That found the middle of Herschel gives his back, and it is just facing away over this turf. So the seventh no ball that Ashnira has bowled this morning. That's been pulled away. There's no deep backward square. And it's four runs, just a margin short. And it's four more. Takes South Africa to 98. turning around very intent to get it as fine as possible to get uh, maximum value for runs lots of boundaries in this test match so far yes, that's neatly played could work with the wrists on that occasion Gibbs that's a fine shot he struck that on the up and a boundary there to end the over 113 for no loss South Africa that's in the air and will reach the boundary. The good thing with that shot was that Kirsten was flashing hard. Really employed two slips and a gully. Gary Kirsten won't be too bothered. You'll just look at the scoreboard and there'll be another four on the scoreboard here in Blomfontein. Zest hard. He's smashed and zest hard. Century. He has been an outstanding player over the years, a player who initially when he first started playing first class cricket didn't think he was going to be enough to reach the test level. Of course I suppose always playing in the shadow of uh, half-brother Peter, but what a wonderful shot that is. this is. It's a uh, placement and that's something I think we uh, often take for granted. He knew exactly where that fielder was at mid-on and didn't try and hit it too hard. Glorious strike. Well, he looks in ominous touch at the moment. Again, another boundary. We saw him do that once to Srinath. Once again, it's a neat shot. And watch the work here with the wrist. So therefore, fine legs got to be pretty fine. And uh, had he been in the position where he should have been. And when he plays shots like that, he does look a magnificent player. That's crashed on the back foot. That was an absolute beauty. I think this is the problem for the Indians. Kumble and Srinath have done a good job. That's majestic. Just majestic. Two boundaries in that over. Back three, 143 for no loss. And immediately, he's been plonked away over the top of the rope for six. Welcome back, Saeed Khan. Bowls, by the time he delivers, he's so wide on the crease. If he bowls ooh, just outside of stump, it's basically going to be hit to leg because of the wide angle he delivers the ball from. Watch where he delivers here. Ball full of length for a shot. Ball full of length time. Ice of low because that was a mistake. Gen it's everywhere. No, that's bad luck. Well, that really is bad luck on Zaya Khan. It wasn't the worst delivery he's bowled, but it's gone for four. And South Africa are 166 for no wicket. Kirsten drives. 
finds the fence yet again. And it's another four for Gary Kirsten. He moves on to 71. Kim Rome, hitch off the back foot of front foot. That's where he likes it. Um, another comment from Jeffrey Boycott. Then it'll be Harsha Bogley and Navjot Singh Sidhu. This is about as bad as a ball can get. Eight fielders in the offside. One solid trim picked up the ball to a ball that's dug in short by the quick bowler. 102 from just 140 balls. 15 4. Got it! He's got him. The breakthrough at last. The persevering Anil Kumle has done it as he had to do. At one, he's really paid that price. Sound of timber, and that's a big wicket for the Indians. Kumle's perseverance has paid off.